Hey, you guys, it's your girl Kia V. All up in the building, all up on your screen, your chocolate queen, a statue of liberty, whatever I am today. That's what I am with my little birthday crown on and my fiesta, fiesta going on in the back. Today, we are going to be talking about the gingham. Fresh, which is the last perfume of the Gingham collection that just came out that I have not reviewed, talked about, or sniffed. So I'm super excited about this. This is the one that's supposed to have the pear in it. Now you guys know that I just recently smelled the Emerald Mist, and this has the sun-kissed pear in it. So I was really excited about that. You can smell the pear in this, but it's still not hitting the way I wanted to. I don't think that this will hit, but you guys can tell I am looking for a juicy pear fragrance and I have yet to find that. Everything is mixed with flowers and daisies and Mongolians and everything else out. So I don't expect anything super major from this, but I was curious. I didn't want to smell it. So the notes in this are juicy pear, sparkling clementine, and fresh daisies. Listen, I just said daisies and everything. It, it is. Here it is. Here it is. But I heard a lot of people say that they actually liked this one. And they like, I think we all liked all of them in general. It was just the staying power. It's just that the volume that we want from a fragrance to last all day that we are currently not really getting from the Bath and Body Works stuff. So. I don't know how to feel about this one. Now, I am sad because I slept on every dang on gingham discount last week when I could have picked up the dang on um, body lotions. I passed on both of them. Now, I'm going to feel some type of way if I like it. And I'm going to feel some type of way because I would like to smell it in general. You know what I mean? Because I feel like when you mix them together, they bring the scent together now. Um, so I am kind of sad that I don't have the body mist or the body lotion, but if the sale goes down, like it's supposed to go down, I think I'm gonna go ahead and get the body lotion from this. A lot of y'all have been telling me that I need to get my, um, Gingham Vibrant back too, because y'all know I returned that. A lot of people saying, girl, we know you love Gingham Gorgeous. That's your babooski. I think you got her on a pedestal. You need to re-smell Vibrant and, and try to get into her vibe and smell her body cream. So, listen, if a sale goes down, if there's $5.50, $5.75, $5.95, then I will go ahead and pick that up again. Um, but until then, child, it can stay where it's at. <laughs> it can stay where it's at, baby. Because I'm not paying full price. I'm not doing buy three, get three for nothing on the website right now. Okay? Absolutely nothing. I'm straight. So, we are going to smell Gingham Fresh. Hopefully, it's good. Pump, pump, pump it up. Pump, pump, pump up it up. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> it's giving basic lotion vibes with a hint of pear. I'm going to let it sit for a little bit. I want to smell it in the lid, though. Make sure it ain't my skin. I be forgetting to smell it in the lid sometimes, too. It's, it's it's gingham fresh. <laughs> it is fresh. It is fresh. Really, really, it's giving a nice hot summer day type of linen with a little bit of pear background vibes to it. And y'all know I'm not super, super big on fresh fragrances. But I feel like I should have one in my collection every now and then to switch it up for the summertime. So I always have to smell like cake and cookies and pies, even though I love it. Listen, do it. Do it. But every now and then, I might want to switch it up a little bit. It might be a little too hot to be smelling all sticky. You know what I mean? All this chocolate and ain't got that sticky smell on me. Maybe I want to smell a little fresh like I just got out the shower. So that's exactly what this is giving. This is giving a laundry detergent. It is with pear. Laundry detergent with pear. What is that? Bounce? Maybe a little bounce in there. But it's not that bad. And actually, this one is lasting longer than Gigam Vibrant. Like it is a little bit stronger than Gigam Vibrant. Because I told y'all, as soon as you spray Gigam Vibrant, it was like, ooh, uh, where did you go? So <laughs> with this one, it's like, oh, okay, you clean. 
You took your shower today, sis. You, you took your shower. You scrub it up, dub, scrub it up, dub, day. Scrub it up, dub, scrub it up, dub, day. Listen, that's how clean you smell it with this one on. It's definitely a fresh smell. I'm not mad at it, though. I'm not mad. It smells like you just washed the clothes. And it got a little hint of pear. It is not a juicy pear at all. It's a pear that's in there. That's spots, okay? Juicy pear is out there somewhere. You gotta find her. Gotta find her. Um, but she is in here very faintly. Very faintly. So if you're looking for something that's super, super juicy, then this is not your girl. Now, I do still have on the emerald. No lie. This emerald smells more like a perfume vibe than this. This is definitely giving you mist. But I'm not mad at it. They're both like lingering a little bit. This one I did have to layer with the lotion. Um, It has a note in there, like I said before. It has like a masculine, like woody note in it that smells like it's the same note that's in Bakaru. And I smell it. But you can smell the pear more in this. This The pear in the emerald mist is a lot sweeter than this one. This one is like pure, you just pick the pear off the tree type of fresh smell. This one is like it has been sitting in a little bit of syrup. Okay, a little bit of that syrup that we like when we go ahead and mix it up with the cocktail, the, the fruit cocktail. That's what this one is giving. This one is fresh from the tree. Take a sniff. That's what it is. All right. Why you washing your clothes? <laughs> Why you washing your clothes? So this is definitely fresh. I don't think it's bad. Is it anything to write home about? Right now, nothing is really making me be like, oh my gosh, I love it. But I mean, it's not a bad fragrance to have. It's not. The Gingham collection in general, I don't feel like they did bad. They did vibrant, totally wrong. <laughs> <laughs> they needed it to have more lasting power than what it does so listen go back and fix that or either i need to get it again and like layer it up with everything to intense the smell because it's really it just dies out on me i don't like that like i want to be able to smell it throughout the day now gingham fresh i do feel like i will be able to smell it throughout the day but this is not a fragrance i will wear in the winter time it's not giving me winter vibes it's giving me pure summer, maybe a little bit of late spring, you know, that's what it's giving me, but it's not bad. If you like fresh scents and you're looking for a super fresh, clean scent with a little dash of um, a natural pear, then this is definitely your girl. This one is definitely giving me more of a cologne perfume vibe um, as opposed to this mist vibe. So there are two different pairs, two different vibes. So, if you were curious and you wanted to know, like, if I got one, is it the same as this? Or if I do the other way, you know what I mean? They're different, okay? Totally different. This one I would even wear as, like, a date night type of vibe. I'm really curious what the body lotion smells like because I feel like it's going to be sweeter. Just like with all of them, all of the, like, lotions are a lot sweeter for some reason than the actual body mist. And it balances it out. But yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. This is nothing new though, I feel like. I feel like I've smelt this before. I don't know where, but I feel like I have smelt this before. The only difference is it has a little hint of pear. That's it. That's it. But yeah, so that's my review on Gingham Fresh. I would rate this... You know, Gingham Gorgeous is my favorite. I like Gingham Vibrant. This is where the toss-up begins, child. Because, listen, I love Gingham Vibrant. The smell, the entrance notes to that perfume, absolutely beautiful. The way that blackberry hits with this sugar, it smells really, really good. But then it disappears. It, it just goes off into oblivion. And that confuses me as to where to rank it. Because I want to say that's second best, and then this would be third. However, this is lasting. And the smell is tolerable. I smell fresh. I feel like it's going to last on me for a little bit because it still smells as strong as when I sprayed it. So it kind of knocks Vibrant out of its place. So I don't know where to put this. Second, third, child, let me know what your, your um ranking is for these Gingham Fresh or these Gingham Collection down below because I'm not sure where to rank it. 
Let me know. Did you like her? Did you pass on her? If you don't like Fresh Senses, this is not for you. But I don't mind it. I don't mind it. Like, it doesn't have to go back. That's how you know it's good. <laughs> it may not be right home to mama. Ooh, I got to let mama smell this one type of good. But it is a good fragrance. It's nice and fresh and very light. And I like it. I do like it. It's not bad. Um, so let me know in the comment section what you think. If you like videos like this, definitely hit that like button. Subscribe up. I thank you so much for watching. You guys already know it is my birthday week. So we are bling blinging it out and we are doing a thing. <laughs> so if you could hit that subscribe button so that we can reach my goal of 2K for my birthday month. Please, please, pretty please thumbs it up leave me a comment down below you know i'm gonna chit chat with you thank you for watching you already know girl i will see you later bye